Carbohydrate counting is a valuable method used to manage blood sugar levels. Over the next few minutes, we'll show you how to count carbohydrates found in typical meals and provide you some resources you can use to help successfully count carbohydrates and manage your blood sugar levels. Food is made up of carbohydrates, proteins, and fats. But carbohydrates have the largest impact on blood sugar levels. Carbohydrates are starches and sugars. Some examples are fruit, yogurt, milk, bread, pasta, rice, potatoes, ice cream, and other sweets. Many carbohydrate foods are healthy, and the insulin you take will allow you to eat these foods and maintain blood sugar control. The amount of carbohydrate that is right for you will depend on your size and stage of growth. There are a few resources you can use to help you count carbohydrates. The first place to look is on the food label that is found on many foods purchased at the store. When using a food label, look at the serving size and total carbohydrate portion of the label. If you don't have a food label, you can use the Calorie King book. This book contains the carbohydrate content of a variety of foods and restaurant items. There is also a Calorie King website and app that you can use to search for the carbohydrate content of foods. The Jocelyn Food Choice List is also a great resource for carbohydrate counting. The Jocelyn Food Choice List can be found at our resource page. Now, let's practice carbohydrate counting with a typical breakfast meal consisting of Cheerios, milk, and a banana. To figure out the total carbohydrate in this meal, we need to find the carbohydrate count for each item individually and add them all together. First, let's use the label on the box of Cheerios to determine the amount of carbohydrates in a serving. The label says that one cup equals 20 grams of carbohydrates. Since you'll be having one and a half cups, the Cheerios will total 30 grams of carbohydrates. Measure out one and a half cups of Cheerios and put them in a bowl. It is important to measure your food for accuracy. You will be having your Cheerios with one cup of milk. Let's use the Jocelyn Food Choice List to check the carbohydrate count in one cup of milk. We see that one cup of milk equals 15 grams of carbohydrates. Since there is no food label for the banana, Let's use the Calorie King app to find its carbohydrate count. The app says that one medium banana equals 27 grams of carbohydrate. When we add the banana to the Cheerios and milk, this breakfast meal totals 72 grams of carbohydrate. Once you figure out the amount of carbohydrate in a meal, your insulin to carbohydrate ratio will tell you how much mealtime insulin is needed to cover that meal. Remember, accurate measuring and counting can help you achieve better blood sugar control. For more information, please refer to our resource page.